Go from a photo to an editable text in Word in three different ways. Let's see how to do that. Get ready to say goodbye to your old case because Casemate has a better one. See the link in the description below. Being in a Word document, go to the main menu and select the Insert option. You can add the images you want. The File Explorer is open where you can choose the picture you're using. Then click on the Insert button. Center or cut your picture to make it more readable. Once you are happy with your result, go back to the main menu and click on the File option. Here select the Save option. Type the name of your document in the File section and in the Save as Type drop-down menu, select the PDF option. Then click on the Save button. Now your picture is a PDF document. The first step is done. Now let's see three different ways to open and convert the PDF to an editable document. First way. Right click on the document and select the Open with option. A menu is open where you can click on the Choose Another App option and then choose Word. If you want to use Word to open PDF documents, select Always Use Word or Select the second option just once. Once you click on one of the options, a message is open to let you know that the PDF document will be converted to an editable document and this will take a while. When completed, your PDF document has been converted to an editable document as simple as that. Keep our creative juices flowing by buying us a cup of coffee. See the link in the description below. Thank you. Second way. Drag your PDF document and drop it into the Word program. As you can see now. As simple as that. Third way. The third way is a little more elaborate but just as effective as the previous two. In the main menu go to the view option and click on the outline option. Then click on show document. Finally, click on the insert option. The File Explorer is open. Select your PDF document and click on the Open button, and that's it. Surely, now you're thinking about what will be the photo or document where you will put this valuable tip into practice. Please like this video and subscribe to our Burn to Learn channel.